So the Heliguide Permissions for Commercial Operations course is really the culmination of all the information that an operator needs to operate their aircraft safely and confidently. Most importantly, this is a mandatory requirement for them to use their drones commercially. Day one of the course, the students arrive early in the morning and they're welcomed with a cup of tea and conduct an icebreaker session where they can learn more about each other and how they intend to use their drones commercially. We then kick off the course with an introduction to air law and this details all the rules and regulations which they've got to abide by as commercial operators. Most importantly, this is where they find out about their separation distances according to the weight classification of their aircraft. It's their chance to get their hands on the maps and airspace charts which they'll use during their complex operational planning. Uh, specifically, we identify a lot of airspace hazards which they need to consider. On day two, candidates get to learn about airmanship principles, aircraft systems, and then finally meteorology. We introduce candidates to some of the principles of flight, and we also cover things like the weather systems which could affect the flight, but also themselves as operators. So by the third day, candidates have all the required knowledge that they need to operate their aircraft effectively. We take them through the complete operational planning cycle, introducing them from every aspect of planning, from the minute they receive the client phone call to the completion of the operation. On completion of the three-day course, you're required to compile an operations manual. Throughout this process, we give the candidate as much support as they require in order to get their operations manual to a position where it's ready to submit to the CAA. Once we've approved your operations manual, you'll be invited to conduct a flight assessment at any one of our three locations throughout the UK. The flight assessment starts with an inspection of a candidate's operational plan and paperwork, after which they'll be asked to conduct a number of manoeuvres and exercises in order for us to adequately assess their competency with their aircraft.